News alert. And that breaking news coming out of Memphis tonight. Just minutes ago, a man arrested after going on a shooting rampage. Take a look. This is 19 year old Ezekiel Kelly. Police say he is responsible for multiple shootings all across the city, and he was recording them on Facebook Live, prompting a message from police for the city, the entire city of Memphis, to shelter in place. Now, this all started around 4.30 this afternoon and led police on a chase for hours that crossed several state lines. Our Danielle Jackson has been following every development here tonight, and Danielle, police have to piece all this together and figure out, first, if there are any victims out there. That's why right, Tracy and Morris, for more than five hours, police have been searching for this man, 19-year-old Ezekiel Kelly. We know he was just arrested in Whitehaven area, which is kind of near Graceland in Memphis. Now the shelter in place warnings came fast for Memphis police. They tweeted out this post alerting people to look out for Kelly and that he was in a blue car and then car carjacked someone who drove a gray SUV then took off the entire time with streaming on Facebook. Now we know police believe he opened fire in five different places. At one point during the search, police say the shooter drove to Arkansas and North Mississippi, then turned around and went back to Memphis. Throughout all of this, Memphis police continued to urge people to stay indoors. Now, of course, this is still an active investigation. We don't know how many people were shot or if anyone was killed. We also don't know a motive, but we did just learn that he had a warrant for his arrest on a first degree murder charges. Now, we will continue to follow this breaking news on air and online. Marius. DJ, thank you. Now, earlier tonight, I had a chance to speak with Mike Collins about the situation in Memphis. Collins is a former lieutenant and unit commander with the Shelby County Sheriff's Office in Memphis. He has 25 years behind the badge. I started by asking him in his over two decades in law enforcement, had he ever seen anything like this? This uh, is probably the most unique uh, situation that has probably only happened once in uh, entire career for any law enforcement. This is very, very unusual. I have never seen anything uh, such as this. The problem with, um, with this whole particular situation is being able to keep up with this particular a person's crime spree. Unfortunately for law enforcement, Memphis is in a tri-state area. Within five minutes, a suspect could be in Mississippi, Arkansas or stay right there in Memphis. So how do you protect the community and keep them safe? Colin says the key is getting accurate information out to other law enforcement agencies and the community as quickly as possible. It goes back to information, making sure you supply the community with good, inf uh, good and accurate information. Um, the, and, and the best information so far was uh, uh, commanding everyone to shelter in place. Uh, do not open your doors and do things like that at this particular juncture until uh, the, the all clear sign has been given. Again, this is still an active and developing situation. So as we've been telling you, download our app. We're going to have the latest information there as well as online. We'll also have our morning crew all over this starting at 4 a.m. with everything that we learn overnight.